So the second question that I normally get is, what do we have to wear? That is a good question. So here is a few tips that will hopefully help you. Number one, it's important to know what the backdrop is. Normally management would decide this is part of the brief. So please ask them, then you know not to wear a white shirt on a white wall. Number two, find out if there's a specific dress code. Do you guys wear uniforms, ties, no ties? You don't want to pitch up with your flip-flops going to Jeffrey's Bay and everybody's in suits. Number three, you have to like what you wear. If you feel confident, you're going to look confident on camera. Number four, jewelry. Less is more. We don't want bird cages hanging from your ears. And guys, this applies to you as well. Number five, photos will be shot from the waist up, so don't worry too much about what shoes you're going to wear. Number six, please limit all patterns, logos and brands. Number seven, choose something that does not have a lot of fluff bollockies. I wondered all week what is the correct English word for that and I don't know. Dust bunnies is maybe the closest. But basically, that top that you've got in your cupboard that has like all the little things that you have to pull apart, do not wear that. And that brings me to number eight. Do a final check before you come and sit here to make sure everything is good to go. Number nine. Bring a second set of clothing if you are unsure about the brief. Something light, something dark, something colorful. Number 10, no hats or sunglasses, except if you're a rap superstar, that will not look good. And then finally, number 11, sleep well and drink lots of water. That's all the tips from me. Remember, we want to fit into a profile and a specific look for the website and the company, but in the end, you want these photos to be a great representation of who you are. 